Today on Riffs, Beards, and Gear, we talk about my one-of-a-kind Buckeye Burl Custom Valentine from Music Man. Now, I recently showed you guys a custom Music Man Axis baritone, and I was so stoked on the new guitar day. But what I didn't tell you was it was actually a twofer. It was a two NGD, if I can say that. And the second guitar was this incredible Music Man Valentine that is really one of a kind. So those of you who follow me on the various social media platforms will know that I have a new band, Rest Repose, has been put to rest. It was put to sleep after a long suffering agony and I am in a new band, Dragged Under, and I needed a tour guitar. I needed a guitar that I could sweat all over. And having just joined the uh, Ernie Ball Music Man family for guitars, I posed the question to my lovely friend, Tim Dove of, hey, I really love this Valentine, but could you do a Buckeye Burl top? And he said, that, that's a great question. I have no idea. Let me ask. Now, obviously the answer was yes. And this is the only Buckeye Burl top Valentine in existence. And it was basically kind of an experiment from the engineering department. Engineering department, I love you all. Thank you so much. And I think it turned out incredible. This guitar feels like you are playing a unicorn, or as I would imagine a unicorn anyway. Now, spec-wise, this is a regular James Valentine signature Ernie Ball Music Man with the exception of the Buckeye Top. But the sound difference between this and a regular Valentine, to my ears, is this is very loud acoustically and it is very snappy in feel. When you are playing it, it is very, very immediate and there is a lot of attack in the top end, which I absolutely love. And the pickups are Fishman Kill Switch Engage pickups, meaning I have voice one and voice two on a pull pot, and then I have the coil tap of the, of the uh, pickups as well for my volume pot. So I have multiple tonal options in a single guitar, still has the three blade selector, and yeah, this is, uh, this is all business. Now, one thing I will point out, and this was kind of for my own amusement, honestly, but on the back, the string ferrules uh, on the back of the body are chrome. And there's a reason for this. And the reason is Music Man was backordered on black ones for several months. And they were like, hey, you know, we gotta, we gotta wait several months for these uh, little string ferrules to come in that match the hardware, the black hardware. And I thought, not just use regular chrome ones, cause A, no one sees it from the front of the guitar while I'm playing it, but I just picture years from now, God forbid if someone else has this guitar, if I'm long dead and my daughter is showing it to her kids or something like that, they're looking on the back of the guitar and they're wondering, why are these chrome, but everything else is black? What, why, uh-huh? That just, that just seemed funny to me. So I was like, you know what? No, put, put chrome string ferrules on the back. It's my guitar, I'll do what I want. But anyways, new guitar day, Valentine Buckeye Burl top that just turned out stunning and incredible. The guitar practically plays itself. Um, it's just a stunning work of art and I could not 
be prouder to be on the Ernie Ball Music Man guitar train. All the pickable links down below in the description. You've been wonderful. I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.